In this video, I'm going to show you how to professionally edit your short form captions to boost retention and increase engagement. And the best part is we're going to be using CapCut for desktop to do this and it's completely free. So the first thing you want to do is import your video into the track down here, obviously. And then after that, we want to add our captions. So to do that, we go up to text in the top left and we go down to auto captions and we click that. Next, we click create. Then once those captions come in, we can see they've been added up here into the player. If we open it up this and play, guy turned one of the biggest mistakes. they look awful. They're very small and they really don't grab the attention. So we're gonna fix that next. So to do that, you just select any of the captions here and we wanna make sure apply to all is selected. We're gonna turn this off in a minute, but for now, when we're adjusting the size and the color of all the captions, we want to, this, these changes to apply to all of them. So make sure you have that selected. And next, we come down to the font and we wanna choose whatever one you really want here. I'll just choose this one for now. It obviously depends on what style your video is gonna be in and we'll change the font size to something like 23. Next, you can change the color. I'm gonna leave it as white for now, but I'm gonna use one of these preset styles down here to put a border around it, just a really thin black border and a few other things you can do here. Obviously you can play around with this, put in whatever you want, but I'm gonna leave it like that for now. And then if we scroll down, we can do some other things like we can add a glow or we can add a, a shadow. So here I'm just gonna add a small black shadow around it, just to add a little more depth to the captions. Now the final thing to do in this section is we wanna drag our caption up a little bit higher in the video because on most short form platforms, that area down the bottom is reserved for, you know, either the comments or the description of the video or something like that. So we wanna have them up kind of, not in the exact center, but just a little bit below. Now, if we go back to the start of this video, we can see there's way too much text in the first one of the frame. So we wanna divide some of these words out individually. So to do that, we just select again, any of the captions and we select captions in the top right hand side. Now we can see it has each individual frame here. So if we click on any of these, we can actually make edits. So if you wanna, you know, capitalize some of the words or, you know, as I said, divide some of them out. So select just before, put the cursor just before any of the words you wanna move into a different frame. So I'll move it to the second word and hit enter. And we can see now in the first frame, it'll just have one word. So let's just divide some of these out really quickly. So now if we go back and play this from the start, we're gonna see it's a lot snappier. This guy turned one of the biggest mistakes of his life into $200 million. So as we can see, it's looking a lot better already. Now there's a few other things we're gonna do here to make this look a lot better. So because the first few words are always the hook, you wanna emphasize them, have a lot of movement in it. So, you know, to, to try to you know, boost retention and engagement of the video. So we'll choose the second caption here, the second frame. And then in the top right, we wanna turn off apply to all. So then any edits we make the individual words going forward won't affect the whole, all of, all of the captions. So here I'll rotate this. I'll make it a little bit bigger. We'll choose maybe the fourth word. We'll do the exact same, but we'll rotate it in the other direction. We'll also change the color of these actually. So we'll change this one to say yellow. And we'll go back to the second one here. And what I'll actually do is I'll just put this say as a blue. So then we'll just make another edit to the third one here. We'll rotate it, make it a little bit bigger and we'll change the color. We'll set this one to orange. Now let's go back to the start and play this through and see what it looks like so far. This guy turned one of the biggest mistakes of his life into $200 million. So it's already looking a lot better. And there's a few other things we're gonna do. We're gonna add some animations. So because $200 million is the end of this hook here, I'm gonna animate an intro and an outro for this. So to do that, you just need to click on the caption. You go up to animation and then you scroll down and I usually choose something like bounce down. into two. It adds a bit of emphasis to it. So then the next thing you want to do is under animation here, you can select out. And if we scroll down here, we can choose something like bounce out. So let's jump back and see what this looks like. This guy turned one of the biggest mistakes of his life into $200 million. Okay, so it's looking a lot better now. There's two other things I want to do. I want to go back to this one that says biggest mistakes and I want to add an animation to this one. So we'll click on it, we'll go up to animation and I'll use something like typewriter. Mistakes. Actually, that's on the outro. So you want to make sure you're clicking back on the intro. So I'll just turn that back off and go back to in up here. And then I'll select typewriter. The so it's going to be the intro. It's not going to have an outro animation. And one last thing we can do to add a bit more dimension to this is come over to the audio up here in the top right. And if you go to sound effects on the left and search for something like whoosh, there's obviously lots of different sound effects you can play around with. So when you do the, the biggest, biggest mistake mistakes there, you could have a keyboard typing, for example. But I just want to show you what I would do for the outro on the hook here. So we'll take this one here that's called whoosh. And actually, if you just click it, you can actually hear it. 
Here we go. So I'm going to drag that into the track and I'm going to put it just at the end where we have the outro animation on that piece of, on that caption. So if we play that now, a million dollars. And no it seems a little bit loud, so we can actually click on it. We can go up to volume here and we can lower it down a small bit. So let's go back to the very start here and we'll play it through one more time. This guy turned one of the biggest mistakes of his life into $200 million. In 1982, an engineer called Lonnie John. So we can see that intro is 100 times better with just a few very small edits to the captions. So if you're looking to build, grow, or scale an online business, make sure to subscribe and go check out the channel because I have a lot more tips and tutorials just like this that will help you do just that. Thanks for watching.